there you go. Devil's Queen Sierra, my 11th awaken. And we get... Hello guys, Soxer here and welcome to another awakening video. So guys, this was this one is going to be my 11th awakening. So, let's go into it. I've been wa I've been saving all these green pieces for so long, I guess that for 3 or 4 months because I haven't done any green awakening lately as you might know. The last awakening was Miracle Orga. He's now plus 7. He's Level 32, I, I transcended him once, and now I'm going to be awakening Ciara. But it was a tough choice because I could awaken Mitty or I could awaken Ciara. Mitty could be very easily transcended, but Ciara can't. But I'm waiting on the new transcended hero that come to us is going to be releasing on the next update. So, um, yeah. But I wanted Sierra first and Mithy, even if I had enough Mithys to transcend, well, to extreme upgrade, so I can awaken her too. But I guess I will be waiting to awaken her after I awaken Zion when I get all the blue pieces needed for awakening him. So let's go and awaken Sierra right now. We have we have the um, the um, awakening discount right now, as you can see. 30% off and I have all the materials as you can see I've been collecting some green some extra green so I can't um, lose the um, track of what materials I need but let's go and awaken her so we can buy her weapons and try the new reroll discount that Compass is giving us so let's go let's see what skill I will get after I awaken her There you go, Devil's Queen Sierra, my 11th Awaken. And we get this quick move. Let's try out the um, skill rerolling, guys. As you can see, 15 discount, 15 ruby discount is very good. So I think I can get like 3 rerolls and then 1 free, something like that. So let's keep rerolling because I already bought. The, um, I already bought the uh, awakening materials, so I guess I can do all rerolls I, I want until I get something good. So let's see what's going to be. We will have money better than quick move. Let's try again. Hopefully, it's going to be very good. Something very good. Again, with the quick move, nothing good for me, I guess. And um, let's try again. Um, overheat? No, I don't like overheat. I want her to be with a good skill even if I won't use her. Look at that! Overcome that. That's perfect for her guys. I like that, I like that. Overcome that is very perfect for her because I, she does so much damage so I guess it will be okay. I wanted something like old but I guess overcome that is better than not or the stuff that I could get because 8 seconds that you, she can be in the battle she can good be maybe she will be good with Lana and Tammy that they have also overcome that I always say that I wanted a team with all overcome that just to try that and then have another team with um, all outs so I so I will see what what skill is actually better so um, let's go and buy the awakening items right now because I need them to be very good because it's Ciara and I will be using her in the arena so let's see what's going to be on the weapon Dragon Skin Ball I guess it's okay, 18% attack, attack speed 12%, critical rate 12% and inner defense 11% Powerful Blow, stuns the enemy with a successful basic attack for 2.25 seconds with a 3.6 chance I guess it's okay I guess it's okay stone is okay so let's go for the for the armor let's see what's going to be hopefully something good is good but not that good because it's only 34% defense but 
they give me one extra stat so it's not that bad actually and 14% mobility, 28% pro control is a little bit low but no no, his the other way is actually very good. 28% is very good, and decrease melee 13% is good. Decrease range 12% is good, especially because she's a, a range hero, guys. So, the magical effect seal increases the crowd control resistance by 13% with a successful basic attack for 2.1 seconds with a 4 point chance. I guess it's okay. I guess it's okay. Now let's go for the premium awakening accessory draw. Let's see if it's, some, if it's something good. I hopefully it's something good because she needs to be a little bit more tanky. Let's see what's going to be. Hopefully something very good. Okay, Moon Necklace. 18 HP, very good. But attack speed is a little bit low. Electricity resistance, you know I don't like that stuff. And ignore defense 10% and it's a little bit low. Now the um, magical effect powerful blow increases a damage by 10% when you attack enemies under attack down, attack speed down, defense smooth down and movement speed down effects. I don't like that because usually you don't get that stats so I don't think the, this magical effect is good. Actually I will try to change that later. But I don't know how many rubies I have right now. Let's see how many I have. Yes, I have 90, 90, 95. So I will start doing some rerolls on my on my org, I guess. Let's see if I can change the skill before ending the episode. I can do two more. So let's see what going. Okay, so barbar instinct is better than restore. That skill still had it. Before having the uh, before having handle salvation, well, actually, goddess and unstoppable power. No, I prefer survival instinct, and I guess it's going to be done there. So let's go and equip all the new um, items to her, and let's see how she is going to be after that. Okay, guys, so I just equipped all to her, and she has 41 attack speed. It's very high. 30 mobility is kind of good and 27 critical rate that is kind of good because uh, it's good when it is over 30 so I guess it's okay at the moment and um, I need to, to buy her custom but I won't right now because I'm I really want to get some some rubies and I want to get um seals and I want to get seals custom before she had this custom that I liked a lot but I really need to um, put her um, the other costume so I can get 2% of each stat extra. Even I don't like that too much, but I guess it's okay. I need to change that costume eventually. So, yeah, I guess it's okay at the moment. So, I guess this is the end of the video. Leave a like as always, and I will see you in the next video. Bye!